से इतना नहीं मिला जितना आपसे मिल लिया हूँ बीबी से इतना नहीं मिला जितना आपसे मिल लिया Hi, this is Samina Sheikh, and with me today I have the very stunning Vicky Kaushal, who is all set to go for the screening. I just spent the entire day with Mirchi. Today I have not got the chance to spend any time with my wife, but I have spent time with Mirchi. And he is of course all set with Govinda Nambira, and I am very happy for that movie. Thank the you. The trailer looks very fantastic, and it was in good interviewing you today. But yes. you know how how nervous are you also because it was your first time, fun side. No, I am very excited. I am very very excited for people to see uh, Govinda Nambira on 16th of December on Hotstar because it's something new I've attempted to do, and with the people whom I absolutely adore and love, Bhumi, Kiara, Shashank, Karan, these are people whom I just have the best time collaborating with. So really have my fingers crossed to what the people think about the film. And since you have. Won the Youth Icon Award, yes. and you know how does it feel? Feels great, feels great. वही मैं stage पे भी कह रहा था यार. To be an icon of icon is is means that you you are you symbolize something, and uh, I am in the quest to leave behind a legacy through my work that eventually people do think that I symbolize something. And before I let you go, what are you manifesting for 2023? Just amazing things for myself and for my, all the people around me. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Hi, this is Samina Sheikh here, and this is with me today. I have the gorgeous Katrina Kaif. Uh, how does it feel winning two awards? Not one, but two. Amazing! I couldn't be happier for K Beauty. I think the entire team has done phenomenal tonight. We've won, of course, the Entrepreneur of the Year and the Product of the Year award, and I think we're all thrilled. It's been a team effort, and. Big, big thank you to all of the consumers and our K community. And lastly, how excited are you for Merry Xmas for your film as well as for New Year's? Very excited. Thank you. Hi, this is Samina Sheikh here, and with me today I have the very dapper Aishman Kurana, whose look is looking very good. I must say that. Thank you as so much. As usual, dapper. I must say that. So, what's your, you know, what's your fashion tip? My fashion tip is this: follow your mood. If you're feeling outrageous, be outrageous. If you're feeling subtle, be subtle. So, I'm somewhere in the middle right now. And uh, after delivering Action Hero, what's yeah. next for you? Dream Girl Two after six months, so I'm excited about it. Yeah. And it's like you know, Dream Girl Two, and you know, you're working with Anuniya Pandey for the very first time. Yeah. What What do you have to say about that? Oh, she's lovely, and uh, I think we have great chemistry in the film, and you would love to, I think, see us. And you are the one actor who's, you know, who's actually ensured Akshay Kumar, Shah Rukh Khan, or Ajay Devgan, or Action Hero's promotions. Me, you have all of them hit literally. I must say that that so that was very cool. How does it feel, you know, actually, you know, reinventing that? I'll always try to do that with myself, with my genres, to reinvent myself, even on social media and films. That's my that's my trip, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> and lastly, what are you man manifesting for 2023? 2023, that uh, entire Bollywood should do really, really well. Thank you so much yeah. for a lovely time. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. So welcoming the style icon of the year, I must say that, and I really need some styling tips from her. <laughs> styling tips? No, you call my stylist. Yeah. Yeah. But but for your fans out there, you know what you do to keep yourself so stylish. See, honestly, I feel like uh, style is very very personal. It's something that you like and it's something that you are. You know, it's an extension of your personality, which is why you dress a different way and I dress a different way. So it should it should never be like you're trying to follow something or someone. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's why me and my stylist always have this argument on trends because she's like, "Arey, but Chris, this is so trendy," and I'm like, "Yeah, but I don't like it." Mm -hmm. So it doesn't matter. So I just say, "You do you." You know, find your own style and what you like on yourself. Don't just follow what people are saying. Uh, some people might like what you wear, some people might not, and that's okay, you know, because you dress for yourself. And my stylist actually said it today that you can be a peach, but there will be someone who might not like peaches. So that's true. But I love peaches. You have delivered a hit with Bhedia. I must say that it's such a you know good film. You know, I thoroughly enjoyed. But you're I coming know. with a lot of projects also. Shay Sada hai, Adi Purush hai, See. the crew hai. You have such a an amazing lineup for 2023. Tell me more about it. Yeah, I mean, there's lots to release. There's lots to shoot. There is uh, Shay Sada. There is Adi Purush. There's Ganpat. There's another film that I'm doing right now, currently shooting with Shahid. Uh, which is also a very very interesting one, and I'm shooting with him for the first time, so that's really exciting. And uh, there is the crew that I'm going to start uh, sometime in Feb, like mid Feb or something, and I'm really excited for that one because uh, I feel like I've I've worked with a lot of men who I really admire and you know who I feel are very very talented, but sometimes we don't really get to work with the women that we love, and I'm getting to work with two women that I absolutely love, um, Bebo and Tabu. Mm. So yeah. Looking forward to 2023 in a big way. And what you're manifesting for 2023? 2023, I think for me is uh, just 
going to be very exciting with all the different kind of work that is coming my way fortunately so i feel blessed and thank you for all the love and um, yeah just like also in in this race and in this bhag daud of doing uh, a lot of work and achieving your dreams also pause for a bit and just be you know with your family enjoy a moment relax calm that's also very important Thank you, thank you so much for your time. Thank you. This is Samina Sheikh here, and with me today I have the handsome, the dapper, <laughs> Karthik Aryan. Yes. And at the right awards, I must say, you know, how what are you expecting? And you are going to get an award, is what I've heard. Uh, am I? So <laughs> I might then. I'm. I'm just gonna explore it when I go inside. But I'm excited to be a part of uh, Femina's Beauty Awards, and uh, and I'm. I'm I'm just happy to be here with all the lovely people, and it's been a great year. It's been a game changer for me, kind of a game changer 2022. Uh, so I'm expecting a lot of things happening in 2023 as well, uh, and yeah, that's about it. And before before I let you go, Karthik, may I ask you a question? Because you know why? You have recently signed an ad with, of course, the most popular brand. You know how does it feel? You know being a part of such good brands. You know of. Oh. Yeah. That's why I said like Karthik, I'm I'm loving it. Loving it. <laughs> yeah. And so, and what what are your New Year's plan? New Year plans? Uh, I, I should answer that. Uh, uh, becoming the Shahzada of all the brands. Yeah. Yeah. You're you're actually becoming Shahzada. Better brands. answer. And uh, 2023. What was the question? What What are your plans for 2023? Uh, and right. for New Year's? There is no plan as of now. I'm uh, I'm still looking at my uh, s- uh, schedules and I'm looking at कि कहीं से मुझे break मिल जाए और But it's a it's a very Isn't good problem. These are breaks later already, and Kantara is also one, you yes. know, on your list. Uh, I'm hoping that you get to do some films like that, you know. Thank are you. you. Even I hope so. Thank you. Thank, thank, you. thank you. Thank you so much for your time, thank and all so the very best. Thank you. So New Year is round the corner, and she's already making that vibe. I think she's welcoming it with a lot of light. I must say that welcoming Janvi Kapoor and Mirchi Plus. Thank you. Thank you. You look lovely. Thank you. You always look lovely. I must say that. I must compliment you. And you have been doing a lot of good job, a good work. So how the year has been for you? I think so far so good. I mean, it's the end of the year almost, and I think it's been a very special year for me. And what what are your plans for New Year's this time? I actually don't know yet, um, but I think what's going to end up happening is I'll probably climb up Tirupati again and call it a day. What What are you manifesting these days? More work. More work. What kind of work attracts your attention? Work that seems like a challenge to me is always exciting. You've also lost a lot of weight for a sports movie. Uh-huh. for the sports movie yeah. and you have been working very hard about it if you could tell something about it that i think all of us are giving a heart soul sweat and bones and blood to this film and i really hope that it resonates with the audiences and are you excited for dostana 2 because it's all set to release next year hopefully is it that's what we have been hearing so i just want only you have been hearing i have not heard any such thing If it's not happening, it's okay. But are you excited for this movie for sure? Because it's something which has already made noise. I really, I really think you know more about it than I do. So I should ask you: Are you excited about? I'm of course excited. Movie? That's why I'm asking you. No, but I honestly, you're a better person to answer that question than I am because I really don't know. Okay. And what are your upcoming projects you're working on, Dhani? I mean, there's Bawal that's ready for release, and like I said, there's Mr. and Mrs. Mahi, and the rest of it is a secret. Okay. Thank you so much for your lovely time, and all the very best. Thank you. Hi, this is Samira Sheikh here, and with me today I have Rashmi Ka Mandana. She looks stunning as usual, and she won the Breakthrough of the Year award. So tell me, how does it feel? I'm very excited, and I'm really glad. I, it just shows me that I have to work hard. It. And, and before before I let you go, you are working in Mission Manjuno. Tell me something about it. How excited are you for this one? Ah, yes, we have a release on Jan 20th, and um, I'm looking forward to it extremely because I think initially when I signed. Um, Mission Mushroom was going to be my first film in uh, Bollywood, and well, goodbye came. So it is both my babies, and I'm really glad that it's finally releasing. And yeah, I look forward. And what are you manifesting for 2023? 2023 happiness and peace and um, health and care for all of you. Thank you, thank you so much for a lovely time. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Hi, this is Samina Sheikh here on Mirchi Plus, and with me today I have the very dazzling diva who is wearing the Mirchi color. I must say that <laughs> it's it's not Mirchi, Canterine. but it's orange, yeah. Orange. But welcoming the beauty, I follow her very regularly because you are just beauty. I mean, like you have been maintaining that for so many years, and you just look lovely. And I loved your last episode. Like I literally sat down and watched that, you know, show. So how was it? What encouraged you? It was so it was so enthusiastic and overwhelming because you know oh I could be like her when it comes to giving up you know you know giving back to people I think that's it I just wanted to say my piece and I think that's what motivated me and that's what 
pushed me, something I've never done, something I've never tried and petrified of. But I think when you're put in a situation, you just overcome all those fears and fears. Like how people follow your fashion a lot, you know, they love it. So what are your five fashion you know, tips which you'd like to give to your fans out there? I think you should always, uh, always have that one piece of jewellery that you can always rely on, whatever, whether it's Indian jewellery, diamond jewellery, gold, but something that you can always throw on at any time, goes with, goes with just about anything. An Indian outfit, lehenga, sari, whatever, idly, you know, radio or mom's wardrobe. I believe in the perfect pair of blue jeans and I'm, I love high, anything high-waisted I, I love. I think that just, it just changes your body type in, in terms of your, how your body looks, it just gives you a nice, even more shapely look, uh, a white shirt, without a doubt, and uh, well, I won't say a little black dress. I think you can experiment with the dress. Could be any kind of a dress, but I think you know a nice dress is, is always welcome. And what's next for Malaika after moving in with Malaika? <laughs> we all have moved in with you somewhere. Well, I'm really glad that you all have moved in with me, and I'm really enjoying it. I'm really having fun doing it. So. Now that I've got everybody moved in with me, now we'll see what happens next. What are your New Year plans this time? Just want to chill. <laughs> I just want to chill, that's it. No plans as such. Haven't really decided on anything. I don't make resolutions. I don't really plan too much in advance. So, yeah, I just want to enjoy. Thank you so much for a lovely time. Thank you. Thank you so much. Hi, this is Samina Sheikh here on Mirchi Plus and with me today I have the dapper Vijay Varma who is looking very stunning. This so look is very good and you have to hide it in fact. Why? Why do you have to hide it? Because I am doing something in which uh, I can't like they've asked me to keep the hair. But after you have made a lot of darlings, I've seen it at least two or three times. After seeing it, my mom has been impressed because she's literally copying it. She's like, you're a girl in your life, like this, 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 like this. So your role was that impactful, I must say that, and people are loving that performance of yours. What do you have to say on that? I was, I'm over the moon with the kind of love we receive for darlings, and especially for a character which was so devious, as your mother mentioned. Uh, it's, I, I feel lucky that you know I can get away with playing such menacing roles mm -hmm. and, and still end up receiving the love of the audience and especially women. Mm -hmm. So I, I, I want to thank all the women who loved me. When, when it comes to your work as well, uh, you know, you have been spectacular. You have been just too good, too brilliant, I must say that. But you have also chosen very different roles. Yes. You know? So do you like be, are you very selective when it comes to choosing the roles which has been offered to you? Yeah, you have to be, right? If you want to like save yourself for the best and you give everything that you have, then you preserve yourself and then you choose the right opportunity and play a good knock, mm -hmm. just like any. Uh, so it's been a conscious decision to choose quality over quantity. Mm -hmm. I like to come out like I've only had one release in mm -hmm. 2022. Mm -hmm. But I, we are glad that it mattered, mm -hmm. that one release. And I'm here because of that one release. Vijay, which film according to you made that, you know, career changing? For you, it was a career-changing thing for you. I think the first event was Monsoon Shootout when it went to a big festival. It was my film as a lead for the first time, and then the second tentpole event was probably Gully Boy, mm -hmm. that got me some attention. Finally, my name was heard for the first time, mm -hmm. and I would say Darlings is also a kind of a game changer for me. And uh, you have worked with Alia before. You have yeah, worked with her with two films and all. So, if you had to choose one of her films, which has been your personal favorite? Uh, this year, I mean, I, I call this year the uh, the Chinese cal calendar will will name this year year of Alia, yeah. because she's had such an incredible year. But I would choose, I mean, I, my feelings lies with Darling, but I think she was phenomenal in Dangu Bai as well. You recently also said that you don't mind. You you in fact know to wear sari and all. So when yeah. will we get to see you in that look? I mean, are you hiding that? If you dig into my Instagram, you'll probably find me in sari or a salwar kameez doing some play mm. years ago. Mm. But uh, but I would I would jump on an on an opportunity to play a character mm. who either dresses up as a as a woman or who is uh, who is an artist mm. who, who performs as a woman. I don't know. Nobody's given me a role like that yet. Lastly, you also said that uh, you don't care, you know, what people think of you on social media, and at the same time, you know how you dress and all. You know, that's a very, very strong statement. And at the same time, you know, being very strong. Do you somehow feel that is a message people need to hear? Because you know, many people right now are also getting carried away what people think about them on social media. Yes, the thing is, social media is. I mean, from what I have understood, it gives you instant uh, a release of whatever happy hormone mm. when somebody likes you. 
but i would say that uh, it's it's not real those people that like your pictures do not even know you you don't know them personally mm. uh, your happiness should not be relying on them mm. uh, or for that matter what people think of the way you look or how you dress mm. uh, because for me my work matters the most and my validation only is restricted to the work because mm. my work demands me to have a exchange with the audience if i do something on screen or on stage i want i'm doing it for to get a response mm. and that response is enough for me the rest is all uh, as you call it like decoration well that's that's nice to you and before i let you go what's keeping you busy which all projects if you could reveal anything about it yeah, while you're hiding I've had, a, I've, i've had a quieter so this is a look for the upcoming film hmm. um i'm I, i've had a quieter 2022 i've just had one release but next year probably have four or five releases lined up so a lot of me is going to be on screen next year so i'm excited about it thank you thank, thank you, you.